So the topic is, should juniors, is, is it not a good look for juniors to play junior varsity? Now, for everybody who doesn't know, like, the different, you know, the levels in, in high school sports, for all high school sports, mm. you have freshman basketball, I mean, okay. freshman sports, specifically for the team just for freshmen, all then freshmen. you have JV, and then you have varsity. Yeah. So for people who don't know what a junior since they've been out of school for so long, <laughs> that's the 11th grade, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. So how do you feel about juniors playing JV? I, I is it not a good look? I, I don't have a problem with it yeah. as long as that junior is also on varsity. So okay. for those who don't know, if you're on the JV team, you can also play varsity. Mm -hmm. You can only play a limited amount of quarters mm -hmm. on both combined. So yeah. you, if you play, let's just say it's four quarters, for example, mm -hmm. you can only play, if you play two in JV and they need you for varsity, mm -hmm. you can only play two if you're playing that same team. Mm -hmm. Now, if you play a different team, that's different. But yeah. if you're playing that same team in the same day, yeah. you can only play a certain amount of quarters. So it's limited. Mm -hmm. So I think a junior, if they're playing JV, they should they should have to they should have a, a varsity jersey. Now if they don't have a varsity jersey and they're strictly on JV, yeah. that clearly means they're not good enough and the school doesn't believe in them. Mm -hmm. Now I'm not saying that they're a bad player, but yeah, they yeah. may not be good enough to play at that school. Yep. Um, if, like I said, if you're not playing at St. Benedict's or like one of those a uh, prep school or yeah, something yeah. like that, then yeah, it's a little tough because um those schools they 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 get those they fill them in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They get them young. They yeah, get yeah. the young players. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, I feel like I feel like a, a, a junior should really be on uh, varsity as well. Mm -hmm. um, in his senior, year, he he got to he got to be killing on varsity. He gotta, yeah, he gotta, yeah. he only, even if he doesn't start, he got to get like a, a crucial role, yeah, yeah. A crucial minutes. You know what I mean? Like for example, for me, my and when I was at when I played for Eastside, shout out to the Ghost. Yeah, uh, my freshman year I played strictly freshman. My sophomore and junior year, I played JV and varsity. I played limited minutes on varsity, but mm -hmm. I did have a varsity jersey. Yeah. Uh, when my junior year, I saw up and down. I was playing varsity. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I, I was like, oh, my dad. I tell my dad, I'm about to play varsity. I'm about to kill him. Yeah. then, they're like, yeah, you want JV and varsity. I'm like, mm -hmm. what? Yeah. I felt disrespected. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you know, but, you know, everything comes with territory. And, yeah. you know, you got to play a role. You know, yeah, so yeah. my senior year, I started varsity and we won the counties and I always remember that. Mm -hmm. you know? shout, shout out to that team. Shout out to them boys. So, well, what do you think on the topic? I think it's not a good look at all. You know what I mean? I don't think it's a good look for... Um, you don't think it's a good look for him to have a JV and varsity? Or, or just, I don't think... Uh, have a JV at all. A JV at all. Mm. But certain dynamics might go into it, too. So okay. some teams might be very stacked at the varsity Correct. level. And also, too, some kids could be a late bloomer. Correct. You know what I mean? And develop the game, you know, later. Yeah. Um, their body, their, um, their awareness of the yeah. game, all of that. So um, I played JV as a junior. You yeah. know what I mean? And... You hear the comments. The yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it's just regular yeah. jokes and stuff like yeah. that. You know what I mean? Because it is, it is the a, expectation. A strike, it is a strike to your ego. Yeah, 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 you know what I mean? It's the expectation that as a junior, you should be developed enough and good enough to play varsity. Yeah, yeah. But it depends on the dynamic of the varsity team, first True. of all, right? Because right? right. they might not have no space for you. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. But also, too, you know, the thing when you can play between um two of the different, you know, the um levels of play is called yeah. swinging. Yeah. So a player might get picked up to play varsity comes clowning or state tournament time because yeah. of bad grades, yeah. behavior, or anything yeah. going on. So it, it's not a good look. So I would tell anybody like a kid who's playing JV, uh, who's a junior's playing JV, mm -hmm. just look at it as motivation. Yeah. You know, to come back stronger. And for example, Michael Jordan. Yeah. They make the yeah. uh, varsity team yeah. in his first try and stuff. Yeah. So it's not a good look. You definitely gonna be, you know, throwing jokes yeah. thrown at you and stuff like that. I'm, I'm gonna keep it 100. But just look for it as motivation to come yeah. back stronger the next summer. And I feel like when we were in high school, not to sound like the old guy, like back in my day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uncle Leroy. <laughs> yeah, Uncle Leroy, Leroy, back in my day. Yeah, but I feel like yeah. back in the days, like it was more like, you just it's the pecking order. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nowadays they throw people to the fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like, like the, not to change the topic, mm -hmm. but like freshmen, the freshmen they're not even fifteen and sixteen years yeah, old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Before we're just only fourteen year old, fourteen year old. Yeah, yeah. You never heard of people reclassifying. Yep. Now all the freshmen reclassify. Reclassify. Yeah. Like we said, we have a student in our school. Mm -hmm. Like he came to me and said, because I coached the school, and he's mm -hmm. like, I'm not when I get to high school. He's a he's an eighth grade. When yeah, I get yeah. to high school, I'm I'm not playing. I'm playing JV or varsity. I'm not playing freshman. I'm not yeah, playing yeah. no freshman. I'm like. Like we talking about, he's like that's disrespectful. I play freshman. I'm yeah. like, yo, it ain't, it's not wrong playing freshman. Not at all. And, and, and what do you think? What do you think about him? You think he should play freshman? I or? think um he's very good for his um for his age and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, but I would say he, he got to grind it out. Yeah, depends on what school he goes to. Yeah, it's true. You know what I mean? So if you're going to a, a group four school, more yeah. than likely you're not gonna play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. At that, at his height, yeah, yeah. but he's very good though. You're yeah. not, they're, yeah. they're not gonna put you in. Yeah. But if he goes to a group one school, yeah, you know. A smaller school, yeah. less competitive. The expectation yeah. for basketball—they just literally having yeah, fun. Yeah, yeah, he yeah. can definitely play varsity yeah. for that level, yeah. but not group four. Yeah. So I, I like his confidence. You know yeah. what I mean? I, one of my favorite students. Yeah. You know what I mean? Good kid, but you gotta be realistic with yourself. Yeah. And I, I wish him the best. Definitely gonna yeah. check him out next year. Yeah, I, f I feel like 
you should you should always push yourself to that limit. Yeah. You should always push yourself to the max and have high expectations for yourself. Mm-hmm. But also, you gotta realize that you're not reclassifying. Yeah, yeah. You're going in there. Straight in. You're going there as fourteen. Yeah, yeah. So these kids going in the school at 15, Six. 16. And you know what? Too reclassifying. You know, you know, basically for people who don't know, yeah. reclassifying is where parents um or coaches recommend to the parents to hold their child back yeah. to get better. You know, yeah. athletically. Not even so. had nothing to do with grades. Nothing, nothing to do like with that. Grade. You know, it can be sometimes. It can, it can, it can be. It can. Or behavior issues and it stuff can. like that but more than likely we talk about for sports, for sports you know yeah. they, they they see a potential to get a scholarship yeah, yeah. or go to the league and to me reclassifying is the new transfer portal yeah, yeah. For, for college sports right now and stuff yeah. like that so i understand it you know what i mean and um it is what it is like like the best kid wins. yeah and, and these kids that's, that's reclassifying these kids are tough yeah, 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 yeah. i went to the game mm-hmm. all the all the freshmen that play varsity you like wow well, you playing freshman if you play varsity yeah, yeah, yeah. he's really supposed to be a sophomore junior. exactly yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, he a freshman but he really supposed to be a exactly. sophomore or junior. Athletically yeah. and physically, he's on a different level yeah. than the kid. Mentally, everything. Yeah, yeah. You're not right up by the crowd or anything like that. Mm-hmm. So, like these guys are ready to go. So when you, you're going against that and you're going in as a true freshman, mm-hmm. you know that's a little, that's a little, it's an uphill battle for you. Yeah, you know facts. I mean? Not saying it can't be done, but it is a battle, you know. So yeah. Yeah, like, you, you got to be prepared and ready for that. And you told me the other day that you was at the game. How was the game that you went to the high school game down at PC? Oh, it was great. It was crazy. Yeah, uh, it was crack, packed crowds. Mm-hmm. Um. Standing room. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. They had an MC, a D. They had a DJ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They had a dance contest. Mm-hmm. Yo, the, that that it was crazy. That was they, the place had, to be. They had yeah, it was supposed to be. They yeah. had um, it, they had, and speaking of freshmen, they had a freshman that was a reclassified freshman. Mm-hmm. He was guarding one of the best players um in the area. Mm-hmm. He has a full scholarship with Louisville. Mm-hmm. Guarding him full court. They yeah. said I, I came in a little late, but they said he, he told the coach like, "Yo, I don't know who guarding him, but I'm a guard. Yeah, he yeah, guarded yeah. full court the whole game." Mm-hmm. And, Second half kind of shut him out. Yeah, you know yeah. What I mean? So I'm, and he's a freshman. Yep. So I'm saying it, but I don't know if you could do that at 14. Yeah, yeah. But he's 15 to 16, and he he was ready for that that challenge. And these kids are hungry. They yeah, see, hungry. they know social media. These kids are yeah. getting these um these deals now, yeah. financial deals, and all this other stuff, scholarship, yeah. going to the league, and they know their time is precious. So yeah. I respect that kid saying, "Yo, I'm a god, the best player," because you know it's county championship yeah. time. You know, in states, and yeah. you're trying to get into the rotation, yeah. and also too like. You know, like you said, it was a standing room out there down there. Like yeah. playing in Patterson, you know, City League freshman, yeah. you know, fre- I'm mean, not freshman, um, Pee Wee, yeah. midget, and lightweight. Yeah. It was nothing at six years old yeah. playing at school. Twenty years over hundred people in the gym. Yeah, yeah. So by the time these kids get into 14, 15, 16, yeah. it's nothing. Yeah, it's nothing. You know the what I mean? The pressure is even. The pressure is nothing. They, they by the time they, they hit that age. Yeah. And listen, at six years old, if you miss a layup. Yeah. In Patterson, <laughs> school twenty eight yeah. Pee Wee game, Joe. You were telling you kids used to be like. Parents, everybody used to tell, tell kids they suck. Yeah. So it's nothing to get yeah, constructive yeah, criticism yeah. at six, seven years old. Yeah. So by the time you, you you get to high school, college, and the pros about the heckling, yeah. it's nothing. Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? Rolls yeah. off you and stuff. So that's dope, though, bro. Yeah, so we uh, appreciate y'all for checking out the channel, watching yeah. the video, yeah. supporting, subscribing. Uh, make sure y'all check us out on TikTok Do and Instagram. Yeah. All one word, can't fake the tape. Mm-hmm. Uh, check us out on YouTube, youtube.com slash at symbol. Mm-hmm. Can't fake the tape. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Mm-hmm. I'm John. Trey McCullum. Peace. Peace.